Welcome back to Powerhouse. When it rains hard outside, for a lot of people, they hear the constant whirring of their sump pump. Did you know that there are ways that you can landscape your yard that not only reduce the use of your sump pump and save you energy, but they're also good for the environment? Tom's going to stick around with us with more good ideas. This is Tom Girolamo, and he is an expert in sustainable landscaping. Hey, Megan. Hi, Tom. Okay, let's start with the basic. Let's talk about a sump pump. Explain to us what that is, and more importantly, why do we need to use it? Okay. A sump pump is part of the drainage system for your home, and it consists of a drain tile pipe that uh, goes around both the perhaps the outside of the foundation of your basement as well as under the floor of your basement. And that drain tile pipe uh, goes to a pit or a sump pit. That's around the perimeter. Correct. It's collected here. Correct. And then what happens? Then the uh, sump pump pumps it out of the house through this pipe and it can go into the yard. The pump has a float on it. Like that, a toilet? Yes, okay. that only it turns on when it goes up. Okay. And the, when the water recedes, the uh, float goes down and turns the pump off. This water is pretty good quality water and it can be used in the landscape. Your sump pump will use 800 to 1,000 watts when it runs. That's the equivalent to 8 to 10 100 watt light bulbs. Okay, well let's go upstairs and you can share with us yep. some ideas on what we can do up there. Right. The sump pump brings the water up from the basement in that white pipe to that outlet right there. But that outlet hasn't been brought out into the lawn area. So the water that's coming out of her sump pump pipe is going right on the planting bed and going right back down into the basement. So what we're gonna do first is put this threaded fitting uh, into this pipe. And notice there's already a threaded part here and it fits this threaded part. And then once we get it started, we're gonna take a, a pliers or a wrench and we're going to tighten it down until it's snug. Okay. Then we're, go we're gonna use the hose. Thanks, Megan. You're welcome. You take the hose and you see a barb fitting here. We're going to temporarily slip the hose clamp onto the hose and then we're going to force the hose onto that barb fitting. We're then going to tighten down the hose clamp until it's snug. So Megan, what can be done with this pipe is that it can just be uh, curled up and left right in the landscape bed, kind of hidden by the landscape. And then uh, when it rains a lot or Heather thinks the sump pump's gonna run, she can uncoil this pipe out into the yard close to maybe a plant that she wants to water. All right, I can do that. All right. That's my kind of job. For even more ideas about landscaping, visit our website at powerhousetv.com.